Hi everyone. For this question, show that the equation of this x has a root between interval 0 and 1. By using Newton Rational method and the first approximation x1 equals to 0 0.1, find the approximation roots of the equation correct to four significant figures. So for the first part, showing there is a root in the interval 0 0.1 using algebraic method. So first of all, we have to get to the function. So bear in mind, for third function, we can't just move it to the left-hand side equals to zero. So this one definitely cannot make your function work. So if you can get the answer also, just coincident by luck only. So in our function, we have to form a convergent function. So what is a convergent function? Most probably, polynomial function will be a convergent function to get polynomial function. So we have to remove our square root, then we square both sides. Continue, we'll move it one by one to the left hand side. So here we go. This is our convergent function in polynomial form. Then using algebraic method, so we have to show that has a root in the interval 0 and 1. Therefore, we substitute 0. You notice that we get negative 1. When we substitute 1 into the function, we get 3. Negative 1 is negative. 3 is more than 0. From here, we can come up with conclusions. The having opposite side. So that sees at least one root follow the sentence here in the interval of 0, 1. Then we proceed to the newton Rasen method part. So for newton Rasen method part, we need differential function. So our differential function will be differential x cubed, power move to the front, power minus 1. Differential 3x squared also same. Differential constant, we get 0. So for the initial value which is given, we follow, which is x1 equals to 0 0.1. Then we start to approximate the rest of the x, showing our method the working must be in full, which is your fx over f prime x. Then we can use our calculator. So we key in the formula alpha x minus function alpha x cube 3 alpha x square minus 1 over differential function 3 alpha x square plus 6 alpha x. Then we start calculate. Initial value which is 0 0.1. So we do one fraction. We must having a decimal which is 1.638. There one four significant figure at the end. So we add once two, it will be one zero. So you can see zero nine. So when you round off, you get one zero. Then we continue for the next approximation x3. So fx over f prime x, where x that we use here is 1.63810. Then this process will be repeat until we get a repeated x here. So 4, 4, 3, 4. Four one five. When you round off, it will become four one six. Continue. So finally, it is repeated. Then we can do a conclusion where. The roots for this nonlinear equation is x equals to 0 0.5321 for four significant figures. So this is one first zero is not counted as significant, so start with here one, two, three, four. 